<laughs> Guys, we just got done uh, doing a jiu-jitsu session here with uh, Marcelo Garcia. Always a pleasure to train with him. Uh, in my eyes, probably uh, the most talented, competitive jiu-jitsu guy to hit the circuit in a very long time, ever since I can remember back. But also with here, another stud, black belt in jiu-jitsu and UFC fighter, uh, Mark Bocek. He's up here preparing for his fight on April 18th. It's the ultimate fight night. No, it's UFC, it's 97. UFC 97. And uh, he's fighting the kid from uh, Sweden or Switzerland? Sweden. Sweden. What's Sweden. his name again? David Bilkiden. David Bilkiden. So uh, I'm sure if you watch the UFC, you've seen Mark Bocek. And we got a good training session today. And uh, kicked my ass a little bit. No, I know. How is, the, how is the training here at Marcelo's here on a full like a regular basis you get up here pretty often when you come into town I get in here about once a week usually on Thursday nights um, first time I trained in Marcelo was in Brazil in Sao Paulo in 06 and then uh, after that when I went back to Toronto he moved to New York so I went a couple of times trained in New York it was a blast it was great and uh, shortly after that he came to Florida and uh, I needed an, a new team to join I joined top team awesome. and uh, you know you got top team you got Marcelo's great combination you know great guys come in all the time like so yourself you come in like a couple months before a fight and get ready alright you too man thank you Take care. yep this time I came in uh, two months before awesome. I fight I don't know if you remember but uh, we were when we were at, when I think it was when you fought uh, did you uh, you fought UFC at Mandalay, um, 79. Clemente? No, Evans? Evans. Doug Evans. Yes. Yeah, because uh, I remember that you fought out there and you had Marcelo out there with you. That's right. And that was the first right. time that I met him face to face. And when I met him, he said he was working with you and I was like, oh man. So right away I started making a relationship with him and I brought him up, you know, for a seminar and stuff. And, you know, it's, like I said, it's, it's awesome to be here with you guys and training and among good people and definitely with Marcelo. So April 18th, April 5th. We got some business to take care of.